Hey Aquarius, welcome back. My name is Michelle. I hope you all are well and I'm wishing you all the very, very best Aquarius. I hope you're having a great start to your week um, and I'm wishing you a great week ahead. We're going to get right into your energy reading. We're going to start with career, job, and let's just see what Spirit God Swiss has to say for you. Personal readings are available if you're interested, Aquarius. You can find the information below under this video. You have to email me, okay? Also, if you're interested or considering joining the channel membership, the link is below for your convenience. You could check that out. Let's just see. Spirit angels and ancestors for Aquarius placement, Sun Moon rising, North Node, Jupiter, Juno, Venus. Anywhere you have Aquarius in your chart, there could be a word in this for you. Now, remember I'm picking up energy, Aquarius, okay? So I could be picking up something you thought about, heard about, read about, or someone in your org sphere. Let's see. Spirit angels and ancestors. What's going on for Aquarius, please? Clear and accurate message for Aquarius placements. Bottom of the deck, we have opportunity. Beautiful. What I see here, Aquarius, is that <clears throat> For some of you, you may be thinking about um, going into business in a different direction. There is a renewal here. Spirit is saying there's going to be a breakthrough that happens, but it won't happen without challenges. Um, the thing is, is that the direction in which you want to go, there may be delays. We are in Mercury retrograde, so be patient with yourself and be patient with the process is what I'm getting here. Some of you, you may, you know, have put some things on the back burner because you feel like, you know, you need to network a little bit, maybe go to school, maybe ask for assistance in some shape, form, or fashion, um, maybe you know, build up your craft, learn some more, or others of you, Spirit is asking you to ask for help, for help from your friends, okay? You could get a referral, go to networking groups, rub elbows with those in uh, the area of business that you want to be in. Some of you, you may be like an influencer or you may be into public speaking. Um, something about your voice is really good for this as well. Like talking to others will help you go to the next opportunity. And opportunity is right here. Okay, yes, yeah, see? Influencer. I knew it. I felt the energy. All right, some of you, you could be thinking about um, podcasting, social media sites, um, pop-up shops, any of those kind of things. But I feel, again, there's some type of renewal here. So for some of you, you may have thought about doing this before or you already started it before and you're going back to something. It's almost like you need a refresher, okay? Because you are going through a growing phase at the moment. It's like you're blossoming and blooming. Spirit is saying, don't give up on your dreams, your goals, and your desires. Continue to water the seeds that you have planted so that you can reap the rewards that you want. Okay, so again, be patient with yourself and don't give up. There is some type of change that is taking place here. And although there may be some bumps in the road, um, keep pushing forward, Aquarius, is what I want to say, because doors will be opening for you. Some of you, you're already there, okay? Like, you're right there. Don't give up on yourself. You may even be thinking about changing jobs, but maybe you haven't heard back from 
some people or maybe you feel like the market in which you are in there's like a freeze or you know some type of delays or something like that now if you're thinking about starting a business or if you want to invest into a new venture and that is all on you your own business your own venture your own creative get started um even though it may not you know happen like this overnight you are headed in the right direction you will have a breakthrough you have to have faith in what it is that you're doing when one door closes and somebody says no goes to somebody else they'll say yes like building and bridging connections networking you know uh getting people's business cards exchanging information um going to you know networking events and attending webinars and things like that will really help um it will really help you out it's, it's all about building with someone else. So I feel collaborations are on the horizon for you. Okay. There may be someone who is an influencer who can uh, mentor you or who can be a huge um, connect for you. They can, you know, introduce you to others, open the door for you. Okay, for others of you, this is what you're doing for others, is what I see here. There's a shift that's taking place um, in the cosmos. And so I guess that's why spirit is asking you not to give up on yourself. Okay, there's a shift that's taking place. And it's not, it's like it's not personal. It's, it's happening for everyone, okay? Um, and so hanging around people who uh, have the same ideas, who can point you in the right direction, um, would be very, very, very cool at this time if you get into those rooms, okay? Yeah, you may feel like something is blocking you. But Spirit is saying, stand on business. Stand on what you want, okay? Stand on business when it comes to this. I feel this energy here that somebody new is coming into your life. And in regards to business, in regards to connections, and it's about selling yourself, okay? Because these people can set you up with the next new opportunities that are coming around here. Yes, yeah, somebody will let you know, you know, they will give you the secret. They will let you know. They're not going to hold any, they're not going to be a gatekeeper. <laughs> they're going to tell you, you know. So also be open to constructive criticism, okay? Be open to the information that you receive. I don't know why I'm feeling like somebody may feel that their third eye chakra is blocked or their crown chakra is blocked or they feel like a little bit fuzzy in regards to the direction that they're going in. Somebody may have um, Scorpio in their chart, Gemini, Libra in their chart here. Yeah, Nine of Cups. Look at that. This renewal is going to leave you in a very, very nice place, Aquarius, again. Uh, keep the faith, okay? Do not give up on yourself, all right? And don't allow anyone else to block your blessings either, okay? Naysayers, Debbie Downers, um, stay clear of that kind of energy, all right? So you can stay high vibrational in good thoughts and good spirits in regards to your dreams, your goals, and your desires. Some of you, you may be thinking about writing a book, doing a podcast, um, there could be a pop-up event that you can attend, okay, like a pop-up shop, um, a street fair, something like that, that could really put your name out there, okay, or your brand out there, all right? Yeah, see, four of pentacles reverse. Do not hold back from your dreams, your goals, and your desires. You're moving through this new growing phase here is what it says, 
Um, so I do feel this energy here where spirit is saying, continue to water the seeds that you have already planted. Like this is a good time to do that. Okay. Maybe going back to something that you were thinking about before. Let the ideals flow. Speak to people. All right. Be open. Because I see you. Look, the five of wands reverse. If you allow... You don't have to worry about um, beating out the competition. You're your own competition. Okay? I feel like for some of you, you may have tried this before and you may have hit a brick wall. Or you may feel like you've hit some type of wall. Or you may even be feeling that now. Don't give up. This is what I'm getting. Don't give up. Yeah, there are people who are going to want to take your information. If you're putting out resumes, <clears throat> I feel like you're going to, excuse me, you're going to get um, some feedback, all right? Now, follow-up is going to be really important. I also feel, again, there are opportunities that are going to be coming towards you, and it's all about collaboration. It's all about networking. It's all about pushing these doors open because the opportunities are here. All you have to do is go for it. Again, if you're thinking about starting up your own business or something, maybe um, find some more information so that you're well-versed, okay, in regards to what you want to say, how you want to pitch or market your brand. Yep, see, the King of Pentacles. For me, the King of Pentacles is more than just a cash infusion. It is... Um, yeah, see, moderation, it fell. So the moderation card just reminds me that we have to be patient and put one foot in front of the other. But the King of Pentacles is more than a cash infusion. It's someone who has more than enough um, of everything that you may need and require. But this is where you're headed. It's with the Three of Pentacles here. So for some of you, this is about pitching to a bank or a producer or someone who can offer you assistance more than enough um, information, a plethora of uh, information. For some of you, this is an actual loan. You're going to have an opportunity to get some kind of money, an actual loan, an actual um, backing. Okay. So this is really good. A good place to end up. Three of Pentacles, King of Pentacles. This is the person with the connections here. This is the right person to talk to. Uh, I'm getting the energy of either a Capricorn or a Taurus. For some of you, you just you want some backing or you want um alone is what I'm seeing. Or you just want more money, more money, more money. And it's like you're working really hard to get this. And that's what it's going to take. Remember I talked about those challenges. No matter what bump in the road it is, persevere. Keep putting one foot in front of the other. Okay, Aquarius? Some of you, there was some type of um, opportunity that you may have gotten in the past. And now it's like, man, listen. I wish I had never taken this, <laughs> but you shouldn't feel like that because you've got an experience and experience is priceless. All right. Yeah, but this person does not gatekeep. Okay, Aquarius, this person is ready, <laughs> ready to help you. All right. So there's somebody who's going to be willing and able to help you uh let's see let's get out one of these regarding the career and move on to love in regards to career spirit what is the key word What is the key word here for Ooh, Aquarius? Oh, okay. Yeah. 
so there's an energy here where you have to kind of there's some type of blending that you're supposed to do some of you you may be cooks chefs um bakers pastry artists um a caterer you could even be thinking about a food truck or um this could be you needing to blend different things together and make something pop so there's something new you're supposed to add to whatever it is you're doing aquarius is what i'm getting for example you know how now you know food is very is very different and odd right the way they make um what's the name of that thing it's like instead of getting chopped cheese is what it originally was like chopped cheese for example now they're putting potato chips in it or they're putting candy in it or they're wrapping it with bacon or they're doing something extra that's what i'm getting you have to make something pop aquarius make something pop okay when it comes to business that's what spirit wanted me to give you and that's what we have all right now let's move into uh, love. We're going to start out. Mm. All right, let's just, let's start out with my Tell All Truth cards. Now, these cards I've had since I started this channel. <laughs> when I first started this channel, I was using these cards. These cards don't lie. I made them up myself. Um, and then I grew out of them. The spirit told me to bring them out. So I am. All right. So let's see. What's going on with love? Spirit, angels, and ancestors for the Aquarius placements I'm resonating with. Clear and accurate message. For Aquarius placements. Let's see. What's going on when it comes to love? Let's get some overall energies first. Remember, roles could be reversed, but flat transpose. My goodness, power couple? Wow. <laughs> I like that. Okay, yes, guarded in the reverse. Beautiful, beautiful energy. Okay, let's see. So you could be running into a king of pentacles, queen of pentacles. So, yeah, spirit is asking you not to be guarded, to be open. Okay, Aquarius, there could be an energy here where you're being asked to be vulnerable even. Like, speak your truth, be who you are. This person is going to appreciate that. All right? And vice versa. I'm hearing everybody isn't what they seem. Okay? So, you may have a few different um, options. Sometimes what we want doesn't look like what we're used to, Aquarius, and that's a good thing, especially if we haven't, um, if we've had trauma or we've had relationships that, you know, left a bad taste in our mouth and didn't, you know, come through the way we wanted it to. This power couple energy is going to look totally different, but sometimes... We have a certain type or sometimes we're attracted to a certain thing. It could be any characteristic. All right. Um, but I feel that we are learning that um, through healing, you know, we, we want to attract something different. I feel like you're attracting somebody totally different than your type, Aquarius. All right. Or they could be your type, but they don't look like... Um, it's something like that. They look totally different or they are totally different. Okay. Let's see. For Aquarius placements. These are never ever gender specific. I hope I said that earlier. Newcomers, hit the subscribe button so you'll be notified when I upload videos for you. Okay. Don't forget to hit the like button, guys. Thank you so much. I truly appreciate it. It helps the video to get circulated. All right.
Spirit, look the cards, fool. Ooh. Chasing you. Okay. So this person <laughs> is going to seem as though they're uh, very interested because they are. <laughs> okay. They're going to keep trying even if you reject them. All right. Let's see. What's going on with this power couple energy? Let's get more for this power couple energy. Feeling on top of the world. Somebody may really be into music, dancing. Okay, they're very expressive. They're very romantic as well. All right. Um, they could be a gifter. Okay. A gifter. They could be well-versed, well-traveled. All right. It really looks like somebody has a lot to offer. They may even have options, but they're choosing you. Now, there's also an energy here where when I say they have options, they're, they date is what I'm getting. They could date anyone because they have, they have charm, they have romance, they have, they have um, money, okay? <laughs> they travel a lot, okay? Um, It says here having a baby, somebody could potentially um, have a baby or get a pet child, all right, is what I'm getting here. Bottom of the deck, we have luxury suite. Yeah, they have money and they travel. Now, this could be you. You could meet this person in your travels. Look at this. Exciting times. It says, let's spend the night together. I want to spend time with you. Fireworks, hot and heavy. Do not disturb. But it looks like this person is not going to, uh, they're not going to give up on you. They see something in you that is exciting. They see something in you. Okay, Aquarius, let's get some um, tarot out here. But it says, exciting times. You make me happy. Being with you, I can be myself i can be myself with you and that's what i was saying earlier um being vulnerable showing your true self they're going to like it okay they're also going to like your voice is what i'm getting ace of pentacles wow page of pentacles they have a significant offer for you aquarius is what i'm saying this is the potential. I mean, we have free will, okay? Let's see. Spirit angels and ancestors, can we get uh, some more information out here? I'm getting love is in the air. Somebody wants you to um, stay down with them as well. Um, or this could be you. Rose could be reversed for Clap Transpose. Because I'm hearing that song, Stay Down by... Mary J. Blige. Somebody may get turned off because this person um, dates or because they have options, vice versa. But the thing is, they want you. They are ready to settle down. They want you. <sighs> now, somebody may feel like this person is moving too fast. Like I said, um, depending on what our past experience has been, it's, it's somebody a bit different. Okay, Aquarius, Six of Wands. Yeah. <laughs> Someone um, enjoys your spirit, okay, of perseverance, the hard work you put in. Um, 
the fire and the passion that you have. This is a time of happiness and encouragement. Um, this person is very encouraging. They want you to win. Okay, this person is very successful also. Now, they could be um, some type of influencer. They could be a person who rallies, okay, who fights for the people is also what I'm getting here. Um, this person could be very, uh, very involved, okay. They could be uh, very involved with like, you know, helping people or like I'm getting rallying or protesting. They could be a union rep. Uh, it's like fighting for the people or something like that. Um, so they could get a lot of attention. Okay, Aquarius. But like I said, they want you. Now, again, roles could be reversed for flop chance foes. This could be you um, who gets a lot of attention. Okay, so we have the two of swords. I feel like Aquarius, this person has a lot going on in regards to traveling, business, um, you know, doing whatever it is that they do. They're very popular. Um, they're very successful. And you may feel like this is a bit much. You may feel like they're a player. I don't see any player energy here, but you may feel that way because they have a lot. Okay. They have money. They're um, maybe on the go. Maybe they're a business person, male or female. They travel for work. They're never really, you know, just being still. They're very active, very proactive as well. And I feel there may be trust issues. But I feel this is a person you can talk to. I feel like this person wants you to open up to them. I feel like um, this person can be very uh, non-biased, okay, unbiased. You can talk to them about anything. They don't take sides. They're able to see both sides of a story. Um, they can play devil's advocate. They have a lot of faith in your, your dreams, your goals, and your ideals. I feel like they cheer you on, Aquarius. I feel like they would cheer you on. Like you have a cheerleader here, okay? We have the Nine of Pentacles. Um, now, this could be a person who's definitely single, is an entrepreneur, has their own business. Again, well-to-do. Um, even if they're not like wealthy or rich in people's eyes, they're able to pay their own bills and yours. They are um, very much in control of their business endeavors, all right? They don't have a whole lot of um, bad credit and things like that. Um, I feel like this person is content with themselves, okay? I don't feel like they have a partner. I do feel that they get attention and they could. They could go out on dates because, you know, they don't have anyone. And the way that you meet people is going out dating all right i feel like this person could have some property now this could even be an older person um for some of you this would be a same-sex relationship but not for all now for the males out there i do feel like this could be a a single um a single parent situation this person could you know uh be a single mother or even a single father Okay, um, but I feel like this person knows how to manage their money very well. They may be into investing, all right? They may be into investing in, I don't know, flipping properties, property management, real estate. They could be into investing in Bitcoin, um, crypto. Um, they know how to flip their money is what I'm getting. Okay, look at this. Ten of Pentacles. 
<laughs> this person is is on their way to if they don't have it already I'm, I'm getting that this person is very well off Aquarius with the power couple energy here now some of you you're the influencer you're the one who's starting your own business you have your own you know ideas you could be getting um, your services are being rendered okay you have a huge following or your following is getting bigger um, you've come a long way you beat out a lot of competition you've won some battles you're successful you're chasing after your money you're chasing after bigger business you're chasing after your goals your dreams your desires and for some of you again there's some type of trust issue when it comes to this person who is like real chill is what i'm getting this is this could be a libra that you're meeting okay they're real chill all right but i feel like you have I don't know you have you're squinting your eyebrows i mean you're squinting your eyes like hmm i don't know trying to catch trying to catch this person in a lie or something like that okay aquarius but i feel that this person is um a loyal uh person i feel like it's an earth sign look the ace of pentacles again somebody is going to offer you something long term and steady Okay, they may, it's, it's almost like this person already knows. They know. They don't have a doubt in the world that you're the one for them or vice versa. But I, I kind of feel like it's this person. This is where you're headed. You're headed towards a person who they just know that you're the one. There could be an age difference here. Now, some of you... <laughs> I see this energy of um, right next to the trust issues here. I kind of see the energy that somebody's going to be looking through someone's phone. They're not going to mind because it's, it's almost like they're going to come out and tell you everything. Okay. Somebody's going to come out and tell you whatever it is you want to know. Okay. I feel like some of you feel like you're going to be taking a risk, but there's new beginnings here. There's a new love. There's a new life. There's a new deepening relationship here. Some of you can meet this person at work. Here you are, King of Swords. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. That's you. That is you. Taking a new uh, lease on life with this person. Taking this on. Look at this. Ace of Cups under the star, mind you. The Ace of Cups, the star, the King of Swords, the Fool. And under that, we do have the Empress. Under that, we have the Wheel of Fortune. Absolutely. There's an energy here, Four of Pentacles. You're going to hold back at first. You're going to want to take your time. You're going to be squinting your eyes, trying to figure out if this person, can you trust this person or not? I feel for a lot of you, you can. I feel for a lot of you, um, this is you healing. This is you getting the attention from someone. And you may not always want the attention. For some of you, you may not be used to this kind of attention. You may not be used to this. It's like you're used to being solo dolo. You're used to having to fight for what you want. You're used to, um, you've been accustomed to um, doing this a certain way, living your life a certain way. And it's almost like girl interrupted or guy interrupted. Someone's going to come into your world. They're going to be asking you questions, wanting to talk with you, very communicative, very open. Um, um, and you may be a very private person. Someone is going to be stuttering, studying you. Somebody may stutter, but like I said, it's not that they don't, they don't have an opportunity to date others. They just want you. Okay, Aquarius? They want you. There's a substantial offer here. With someone who is loyal, someone who is dedicated, someone who says what they mean, someone who, you know, if they tell you they're going to do something, they're going to do it. That's what I see here, Aquarius, okay? Um, let's see. Let's get, um, let's see who, what signs we might come up with. 
and close this out for Aquarius with these exciting times. Oh, yeah. They may even used to go to the club and stuff like that. This person does love music, but they're not going to be doing all of that. They're not going to be doing things the way they did it before they met you. As far as dating, going out, hang, hanging out until 2 and 3 and 4 in the morning, you know, in the club. They could even have a social club that they usually hang out with. They're not going to be doing that. They'd rather be with you, is what I see, at home, yep. They want to build a life with you, Aquarius, okay? All right? Is what I see. Roles could be reversed for flop transpose. This is a really good um, reading for those who you, those of you who receive it. <laughs> okay, Cancer is here. Oh, we have the Sun, so it could be a Leo. This could be a very empathic, intuitive uh, person who is very comforting, protective. Yeah, this person is ready to risk their life, okay? They're ready to, they're ready to fight for you, Aquarius, is what I see. Now, don't get me wrong. This person is not perfect. No one is, okay? But they are family-oriented. Sometimes they're, um, they could be very introspective and I feel it's because they study it's like they study you okay Aquarius that was a fly I don't know are y'all seeing lots of flies that fly came out of nowhere I just thought I was gonna have to fight <laughs> um I don't know why I'm here and they're not like us so this person again they may be someone who fights for the people in some shape, form, or fashion, or they stand up for what they believe in, okay? I also feel this energy that this person could be very um, loving, caring, all right? Nurturing and kind. Um, this could be what they see in you, Aquarius. They may be very comfortable with you. Four pals, this cancer energy, okay? Um, we also have the moon here. Okay. So the sun and the moon. Yeah, there's feelings here. Okay. Um, but I feel like somebody is, is kind of fearful because this person comes on strong. Their energy is very strong. There's something about a, a mystery here. So what I'm seeing is um, Cancer, Leo, Pisces, Scorpio. That's what I'm seeing. One last card. Yeah, this this person is going to be a, a mask. A very if it's a male that you're interested in, they're going to be very masculine. Okay. Very much in their masculine, um, protecting, very creative. They may work really well with their hands. They have a beautiful personality. They want your attention. They like to be, they like to be, um, acknowledged in a way that is like, um, oh, you look nice. Like, yeah, I'm getting, they like to be complimented. Who doesn't, right? All right. Oh, wow. North Node, Destiny. Okay. Aquarius. This person is a part of your soul tribe. This person is going to bring you fulfillment, but in ways that you guys can build together. Power couple. There's a purpose for you guys um, getting together here. You're going to grow old together as well. You can build. You can produce you can develop with this person. This person is meeting you on your path. They stand in integrity and they're, they want you to stay down is what I'm getting. You may meet this person suddenly in your on your journey here, Aquarius. 
this is what I have. Until next time, please take care of yourself <laughs> and be well. Beautiful energy here, Aquarius.